Hello everybody, Simon here and what I'd like to share with you today is that you're more than just a human being. Um, for about 18 months ago I had a very deep experience. I, uh, After I woke up I took a walk in, in nature and I, I saw this mountain and I literally realized or I could see it was a feeling, it was a knowing when I looked at this mountain that I did not look at something outside of me. Actually I was looking at an expression of that which I am. And it was a very liberating feeling, a very uh, strong, real experience. Like I, I looked at the mountain in the sky there was an airplane I looked at this and I, there was literally no separation at all no separation no filters and I could see this mountain and I could see that this mountain is an expression of source and I am source so basically wherever I looked I could see I, I, I could see an expression of source and an expression of source is like you know like a wave on the ocean it is not separate from the ocean itself and I am not only a wave on the ocean I am the ocean and you you are not only a wave on the ocean you are the ocean of course I'm not you know excluding anybody from this but ultimately what I realized that day is that everything comes from the same source and I am that source um, and ultimately um, your body your, your, sorry, your consciousness is not in your body. Your body is in your consciousness. And basically when we grow up, we, we grow up with these uh, ideas. Like, first of all, when we're young children, we don't have this idea of separation at all. We, we're just one with our experience. We're just one with what is. But then as we grow up and we, we start to create labels we put labels on things we label uh, this is a chair this is a table this is a mountain etc and we separate ourselves from that like I am this body I am these thoughts I am this personality structure I am we start to identify with things we start to create this is self and this is not self but ultimately what I realized that day when I took that walk is that everything is self and that these labels that come out of separation are ultimately illusions and illusions do not exist. Illusions simply just do not exist, they're illusions. So when we let go of believing in illusions, when we let go of trying to bring illusions to truth, we can experience and remember what we really are and this is what I want to share with you because this experience was such a profound experience that I simply just it's still this experience is still alive for me it's still it's more more or less alive for me through throughout every day when I you know, look at things. I, I I get this strong feeling, and it and it's um basically everything is self. Like you are source, and source is expressing itself through you. You are a unique individualization of source, but you are also source, and everything, and thus you are everything that is an expression of source as well. And this. A Course in Miracles talk about this, that the way to remember God is to see your brother, is, is to see the Christ of God in your brother, in your sister or brother, to see and ultimately when you look at somebody you don't see another, you see simply 
because who you look at is in your consciousness and everything that is in your consciousness is an expression of source and therefore is what you are so when you look at somebody you don't see somebody else you see an expression of source and since you are source that source that is also what you are um, we're all one with source and we are experiencing ourselves and the universe subjectively um, what else do I want to share I want basically this everything is self like you can see when you look at into somebody other's eyes or somebody's face you can literally see yourself like you see them and you don't see something outside of you you simply recognize the same oneness, the same truth, the same being that you are in this person's face. And uh, yeah, simply all of this, like we, when we grow up, we also form these sort of like preferences, like we identify with things like I want to be seen as this, this is what I am, this is what I'm not. This group of people represent this, and this is, and that is not what I am. I am this, etc. We sort of form this illusory sense of separation between ourselves and other people, but ultimately, that these are just illusions, and they simply do not exist. And basically, there is no other. That 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 the idea that there would be an other is simply an illusion. When you see somebody, you can simply see them as yourself, and this to me, and that, that and and that's what they talk about in the in, in the Course in Miracles. That the way to remember God is to see this oneness. Simply see God in your brother, so you don't see somebody else. Like you don't separate yourself from what you're seeing. You realize that the seer, the witness, is one with what is witnessed. And uh, this is a way to remember God. And, and, and the experience that I had that day was so, so profound, so liberating. Like I, I looked up in the sky and I saw this airplane. And uh, basically this airplane, there was like there was no, it, it was as if this airplane was in my mind. You know, it, it's not, it was not outside of me, it was not something else. And, and there was no separation between the airplane and the sky around, it's simply one expression. And um, that's what I'd like to share with you today, and have an amazing day.